The very first boss of Link's Awakening, which is the best Zelda, is this crazy worm thing named Moldorm, and when he knocks you off of his platform, you'll fall into his dungeon where there are skeletons hanging from the ceiling, and that's surprisingly macabre for a Zelda game. But in this example, I'll map the rock's feather to my B button so that when I fall off the platform, instead of falling down through the skeleton room, Zelda will jump up through the ceiling and end up in this version of the skeleton room, which is... Different. Now there's a lot of weird stuff that you can do with this glitch, but if you walk toward the bottom of the room, then continue traveling to the right, you will see a series of empty rooms, but if you keep traveling to the right, you will eventually make it to the room that houses the full moon cello, and some of the tiles will function like water, but if you can manage to grab this thing that is clearly a musical instrument, you will have beaten the dungeon without fighting the boss. What's funny here is that instead of music notes coming from the cello, you'll see these sprites that look like Mamu the Singing Frog, and I suppose that's appropriate. Depending on where you explore, you might end up in an entirely different dungeon, and I'm not sure how this glitch can affect a save file, so like, maybe try it on an emulator and tell your friends I'm great.